breakfast by Jack Pravet or oh, Jack Pravet. It's a French name. You can pronounce as you like. It is translated by Regi Sirivardhana. Uh, Regi Sirivardhana is a Sri Lankan poet, English poet, uh, not uh, internationally recognized, but he has done, uh, contributed Sri Lankan English literature too much. There are so many poems and other literary creations done by Regi Sirivardhana. He's a Sri Lankan English educated scholar. We must clap. Now, he has translated this uh, French uh, poem into English. Mm. Now, we are going to read it. Breakfast. Breakfast. It's a very simple poem. Modern poem. In a sense, it is a modern poem. What is modern poem? Hmm. Modern poem is a poem written on modern subject matter. Hmm. This is not about nature. This is about human life. Modern human life. Written by a modern man of modern society. Now we consider our present society is modern. Hmm. And a year ago, the society was old. Now, the present situation is modern. Right. When we go to 2024, 2023 is old, 24 is modern. That is how we consider modernity. Right. Now, uh, this breakfast, the poem Breakfast, depicts uh, human relationships in modern life. Human relationships. Hmm? It's very important. Relationship between individuals. Now, now this breakfast is symbolic of that uh, relationship. Now we know at home we take our dinners, lunches, breakfast together. Together. Mother calls you, it's breakfast time, come and have. Right? Breakfast. Everybody come for dinner, everybody come for lunch. What is for dinner? What is for breakfast? What is for uh, something like that you question. Because this taking food together is a human action common to humans. Other animals, they are very selfish in eating. Sometimes they fight, they clash, they conflict. Animals, there is no peace between them when they are up to eating. But humans, Taking, sharing food uh, is unique to them. Unique to them. Because they share, they prepare food, they share them. Sometimes your mother feed you food. When you get ready to go to school, when you have no time, sometimes mother feed you. Right? Therefore, food, sharing food, is unique to humans and it symbolizes their unity. Food means, sharing food means humans' unity, relationship, hmm? love, affection, kindness, everything, all softer qualities of human heart, all softer qualities of human heart, are shared uh, at breakfast table, at dinner table, at lunch table. You share. Uh, therefore, 
this poem is very special to our lives. Very special. You have to think of it. You have to think of your life. You have to think of the life of modern people. Are our relationships healthy up to date? Mm. Is the relationship between our family members are up to date, healthy, sound, mm. or weak, or bad. Now you can think of it after reading this poem, after reading and understanding this poem. Now this is the story, subject matter of the poem. There are two uh, persons in the poem, we do not know who they are, right? We only see some sort of relationship between them. Definitely it could be a man and a woman. Man and a woman. Their relationship is not really mentioned. We do not know they are mother and son. Father and mother, uh, brother and sister, or two friends, or two lovers, could be any. But the main theme is the relationship, loss of relationship, breakdown of their relationship. That is the idea. Now let's understand the subject matter. Two persons arrange a breakfast. They arrange a breakfast at home or outside home. Don't worry about the situation. Don't worry about the situation. There is a man and a woman seated at a breakfast table. They are getting ready to have breakfast. Right? Now this man, he prepares his own breakfast. There is coffee, there is bread, there is milk on the table. He takes it. He does not look at the woman. He does not even speak to the woman. The woman is just staring, looking at this man. She does not even speak. She is also silent. And man prepares breakfast and he completes it. After completing his breakfast, he smokes a cigarette. And after smoking cigarette, he goes away. The woman is still wondering what is happening. She does not eat breakfast. She is worried about the situation. He goes away. They arrange a breakfast to share their feelings, thoughts, ideas, comments, and even to fight. Nothing happens. Nothing happens. The man eats breakfast himself. Silently, he leaves the place. Woman is still there crying. Ah, that is the subject matter. That is the subject matter. It's very simple situation, very simple event, but it has a serious message to our lives. It has a serious message to our lives. What is this message? That is the theme of this poem. Breakdown of human, human relationship. Breakdown of human-human relationships in modern society. In modern society, 
we humans are separated from each other because of our busy lifestyles. Sometimes because of our selfish selfishness. Mm. We have lost communication, exchanging ideas, thoughts, feelings, comments between us. Breakdown of communication. We are not open-hearted today. Mm. We are close-hearted. Mm. We are close-hearted. We are not friendly anymore. We are not friendly creatures, animals anymore. Mm. We have lost unique human values. What are unique human values? Unity, love, affection, togetherness, sharing and caring. We have lost in modern society. Right? That is the idea of this poem, Breakfast. And in our next session, we read line by line, line by line, and interpret and understand what the proverb, the poet proverb tells us about our lives, about our lives. In our next session, we'll discuss it.